Hello and welcome to Let's Play Dark Chronicle. Right, when we last left off, I went to Starlight Temple and bought a lot of crystals. I mean, seriously, a lot of crystals. Now, there is one thing that only occurred to me when I came back. The weapon might have a limit to how much beast it can actually have attached to it. So, let's be reasonably careful here. Spectrum is 10. It takes it up to 55. And then we'll add two at a time until we get um, to its upper limit. Because we want to add as much beast as possible to the new weapon, but obviously the weapon itself can't go above a certain point. It's up to 10, so that was alright. I'm not going to have to think of what else I can attach to this weapon, actually. Then. I'll have to balance some of the Wildcat's weaknesses with the remaining points. Ah, that only raised 5, so it's a little bit 60 by the look of it. Okay. So... Doobie doobie did. So really, lightning appears to be the main weakness of this weapon, so... Let's spectrumize... Actually... Spectrumize 5. And then we'll spectrumize... Five. I'll spectrumize five um, wind crystals to it as well. So that puts its cyclone up to a nice round forty. Okay. Let's re equip the Wildcat. Let's spectrumize the magic gun. Wait, what's that? 36 points being added. So it'll raise its beast to 54. How much more do you need, who do we think? Is 12 going to be enough? Let's quick save before we do that. If not, it's not a problem. We'll just, um. We'd need more synthesis points to. Uh, actually, quick load. I'll spectrumize three. Reason for this is, if I um, need to upgrade it to plus six. Once I upgrade it to plus six, I'll have enough points to attach another weapon onto it, so we can always go that way around. But if that's enough, it isn't. Okay, so we need a weapon. That probably won't contain anywhere near enough. The bone rapier can well, has a small amount of beast. Another three points won't do it. So what I shall do is I shall actually go into the dungeon level. So, let's continue. We're getting the Wildcat to plus six. And now that that's done, we are about two away from the thing, I think. Desperation on the mountain. Time to feed a monster 710. Speeder and monster transformation. Let's go. I'm fairly certain I repaired all of um, C's parts. Well, we'll find out in a moment. Not as if we're hurting for high-powered weapons, so... Oh, that's much better. Meanwhile, Steve, heal. That hits. That hits. This is going to be an irritating little speed on level, I think, looking at this. Okay, there's another enemy over there. It's a bomber head! Which we don't do a lot of damage to. Steve, you're up. Once it's plus six, it should be okay. There we get some more beast crystals. Well, panto crystals. Names are interchangeable, they always are. Ah, 
Yeah, that's fairly... It's, it's now actually a suitable replacement weapon for the question shooter. Sturdy rock. And in here... Chill crystals. What actually weapons do we have that can... I suppose we always do have the grenade launcher, but I prefer not to use that. The bell trigger, maybe. Just seeing if I can cover any of its weaknesses off at the moment. Actually, that's already a plus seven. Yeah, we might use the, um, we'll actually use the grenade launcher. Yeah, we're not quite as tough against that thing. We did leave it to you, it's defeated now. And there's another treasure chest. And of course we'll get the speed plumber to plus five very soon. Mellow banana. Probably gonna find out there is a oh, the only way rounds round there very soon. Yeah, well. yeah. We could to always do the truck do the classic gun, but it, it's just got nothing worth attaching, so it'd be almost a waste of five synthesis points to attach that. The grenade launcher at the very least has stats that um, it already has, so it will improve the weapon somewhat. Right, over there's a geostone. And around here, there's an enemy. The enemy is defeated. As you can see, we're really struggling to get it up to plus six. That was bad. Alright, uh, half our health. That's not a problem. We have plenty of healing stuffs. We still have all of those crunchy breads from ages ago. I might have even used them for the end of the game, which seems a bit of a waste. Uh, mind you, they shouldn't really. They should be for the party. Yeah, I haven't been on a major recruitment hunt because, as I said, I did all of the recruitment really early on. I don't think there's anyone you need still in Palm Brinks. There's certainly people you can recruit, but um, I'm not sure if there's anyone I need to recruit. And if there is, I'll find out very soon. So, treasure chest. And within the chest we find... some more hunter crystals. Yes, after buying 20... 20 odd of them, it's not a surprise that I'm finding loads of them. Sod's Law for you. Right, well, where's the map? So, long way to go. Steve, you're up. You're up, you lazy behind! Enemy is vanquished, and we get all the ABS. Right, there's three of them down here. Starting with a burger. Right, that'll do. Max, go and grab all the ABS. Right, so both weapons very nearly leveled. Water cannon. Leave it to me. Yep, dodge. Well dodged. Right, now that that's up to that, let's go and attach... You know what. Probably really limited in how much we can do it, but I don't think we need much. Oops. Well, sure, we wanted to do that, but... All 
Alright. Equip the grenade launcher. Go. And now the speed club's level. So let's actually waste time upgrading it. We got beast crystals. Look at the amount of services points we got for this. I doubt it needs anything really, but we'll keep going. So Beast Crystals. I just want to get rid of this flamingo to be honest. Still needs more beast, not a problem. But let's finish off the cyclone. So I reckon if it's 30 and 30, that's not a problem. No, still needs more cyclone. I'm going to regret this, aren't I? Uh, is that another 4? We'll take it up to 40. Can we buy more crystals? And it's not as if we're going to run out of synthesis points. 42. We might run out of synthesis points. Alright, this takes it up to 50. If we need more than 50, this is getting ridiculous. I want to get rid of a speeder club. That's enough. Right, so we have plenty of these. Can we? We're not going to need 17. Let's try 7. I just want this club improved. It builds up to a falcon. So, the Flamingo is now a falcon and has precision attached to it. It is good for long shots. Right, so now that we have... That's, quite an, that's a much more impressive looking speeder club, I think. Let's go out there and improve it. Uh, use a key on the treasure chest, because we have plenty of them at the moment. Oh, nice. No, very nice. Thank you very much. That was a good use of key. And that takes the grenade launch to plus one. I might experiment and see whether I can raise the classic gun by enough. I mean, the other thing to think about is, of course, uh, the most I can raise it with five synthesis points is 15. So I'm not sure actually using the classic gun is going to improve it at a better rate, if that makes sense. If I can't attach more than. Uh, there we go. Right, all enemies are vanquished. That looks like more right. impressive with that. That takes care of you guys. Put my speed on the floor. Let's not move directly to a sphere though. It does fire grenades. It is cool. Right, Steve, get us to where we want to go. And then where we want to go is down there. You're lazy behind. No. I've earned my right to go and um, fly around with my Get brilliant little machine. Uh, this is what happens when you give machines free will. Okay. So, first test shot of the Falcon, and look at that, I've made it worse. It's got a precision reap thing attached to it as well, depressingly. But the range of it, sh it's got a much longer range than the last one. Even more careful with that, and that was just. But that. Where did I hit? That was backspin, sure, I'll take that, but I didn't think it was. Um, you don't want to hit the ceiling, you also don't want to hit this too hard. Good hit. Okay. Shots, we got like three remaining. So we want a very short shot over there. 
Well, at the very least, that couldn't go very wrong. And my phone's going off or something. Yeah. Okay. No worries. Alright, just need to get it into the area, and then we've got one shot left to um, finish up. Come on, stay. Oh, that could be problematic. Actually, I'm not sure I can, I've got enough room to bounce that. Oh uh, well, random bounce shot off the wall then. He seems our best bet. The walls are not straight here. Alright, let's go for a bouncer. Bouncer with backspin. Ah, oh, did he do it? More powerful. Bouncer with backspin. Oh, I've messed this up. A more powerful bouncer with some amount of backspin. Hmm, I seem to hook that and slice it, which, well, golfing terminology, I messed up. Come on, severe backspin would be nice. way I can do this then is with a ridiculous bounce off the wall. It's going to have to be fairly ridiculous. Full power then. Yay for full power randomness. Okay, I'm going to experiment with this for a bit, so until then. Well that was nightmarish. Okay, let's find out what's on this geostone, if anything. What grain arm restored, parts shop restored. So we have a serious requirement needed. Okay. Nothing about that. So I shall repair all of the um rifle parts and then another dungeon level. Until next time.